So as of the time of posting this video, a new voice actress has been updated for Platinum already, replacing the previous one, the previous one being Kayano Ai. The new voice actress is a Japanese voice actress, her name is Mizuki Kitajima, and we're gonna be using this video to react to the old voice actress and compare it to the new one to see whether or not the new one did a good job at uh, emulating the experience of Platinum. Is it gonna be about the same feelings? Is it gonna be the? Is it gonna be a better, improved version, or is it? Or is it not gonna hit the same way that Platinum once had before? So. I'm gonna use Mr. Gotcha's video to react to the new voice actress and then after Ekajin's video to react to the old voice actress. We'll do a side-by-side -side comparison of the two to see how we find about this change that happened in Arc Nights. So let's get to it. Alright, so I have um, Ekajin's video right over here. So let me play the old voice actress first and then after this we will watch the new one. We're gonna listen about four lines in, then we'll play four lines of the new voice actress. Maintenance so, Platinum has this like very um, moody feeling, moody outlook. It's kind of young yet mature at the same time of a voice that she goes along with. So, now the curiosity part is that this is what Kayano I did for the previous Platinum. So, now with the new one coming in, Will she bring about the same feels? I'm honestly not too confident, but let's listen to the new one. Alright, let's play it. Hold on. Doctor, <sighs> そんな Hey, wait, 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 wait. I, I gotta say this. I feel like I'm listening to the same Platinum, except that there are some distinct changes to the new Platinum. The first thing of all that I gotta put is that the tone of voice of Platinum is kind of along the same line, don't you think? The way that the words are going like up and down, the, the intonation of the words, they're all about the same. But yet this one has a bit of a distinction whereby... The, the the voice sounds more crystal-like. I don't know if that's the best way to put it. Like, the previous one, I mean, considering that that voice came in when the game first started, but this one is like two years later. For some reason, this one feels like maybe there's like a better microphone or something. Then the, the voice is so crystalline. And then, yet at the same time, I find this platinum to be more moody than the previous one. Like, there's actually more emotions and feelings that's coming across the new Platinum. Um, you, when you hear the yawn, you hear the, the pace of the speech, you can feel like... This feels like it's actually a perfect emulation of what Platinum would be. So, honestly speaking, I am very impressed with what Mizuki Kitajima actually did. Oh, we're gonna listen on for more voice lines just to do a better comparison, because this is just the first four. But the, the last point that I want to put is that the new Platinum sounds younger a little bit like it's not ultra young she just sounds like she's someone who's like around her 20s or something so honestly it's just very very sweet is i'm enjoying the new voice actress a lot now but let's play on with the old voice actress again and then um, play about four more lines to compare it to the new one <laughs> Yare, yare. 
そんなことをわざわざ聞いてくるなんて乙女心がわからない人だねえプラチナという名前の由来そうだなカジミエーシュのナイトスレイヤーにはキラーランクってのがあって私より上には最高位の黒金が3人その下のラズライトが2人いてさでもプラチナランクは私が死ぬまで1人しかありえないからいっそ名前にしてもらっていいかなあっあそこにミオールさんがいやいや彼女に手を出すつもりはないよそれより向こうの方こそ私を見るなりあのハンマーを振るってくるんじゃないかって。Okay, so those are three lines of the old voice actress. Let's hear the new one. 手持ちの仕事を片付けたら帰ろうかと思ったけど。気が変わった。理由やれやれ。そんなことをわざわざ聞いてくるなんて、乙女心がわからない人だね。The way that she says r e y u Like, that's reason. Really, you? Like, she said it so nicely. Oh. Pratina to you, no, my no, you're right. So, the no. Kajimiation, no, night, slayer, and you are killer, rank, good, the no, got the. What a sure you, when you are, psycho, you know, Kuroganega, sunny. So, no, she, no, Razlight, no, got a little, so. Demo, Pratina, rank, wa. 私が死ぬまで一人しかありえないからいっそ名前にしちゃおうと思ってねおあそこにニアールさんがあいやいや彼女に手を出すつもりはないよそれより向こうの方こそ私を見るなりあのハンマーを振るってくるんじゃないかって心配なんだよね How did Hypergrip manage to find someone that sounds exactly like the old Platinum but yet has its own distinct features that make this one, to me at least, to me, I don't know to some of you, but to me this is a lot more likable than the previous one. Dude, it's. I. My heart flutters when I listen to this new voice actress. Like, there's a more fuse, I feel more moodiness, and like, it's. The emotions are played so well. I feel like I'm personally there with Platinum right now. Dude, I'm about to become a platinum simp at this rate, but like, honestly, Mizuki Kitajima did a very good job at mimicking the voice of、uh, the old platinum. If let's say you got platinum as your、uh, assistant right now, and then you hear this new voice, I don't think you may even recognize that there's a new voice that got added to the game, because It sounds very much like the old one. I feel like I don't really hear any difference. I really gotta say that. The, the move done here is honestly amazing. I think Hypergrip did a great job at hate hunting the a, a best fit for、uh, the replacement of Platinum. And to some of you who are saying that you know,、uh, you're know o y u very angry at the replacement, you know, you don't like the fact that Kayano Eye is、uh, being taken out and whatsoever, the, I'm not going to describe too much about what happened within the entire situation. But even so, controversies always happen, and these kind of things are important moves that c o m p a n y have to make. At this point here, It's come down to the point where this has to do with the safety of the company. And if, let's say, the company doesn't make the changes that they want, who knows if we are still gonna see the game today? We don't know what's going on with the company. And if they don't make the moves, then we don't know if they're gonna be threatened by the country that they're located in. And at the same time, we run the risk of losing a game that we really love to play. So, to all of you who's giving like one star reviews on like app stores or play stores, I gotta just tell you out and call you out that that's pretty damn dumb. Like, why are you even doing that kind of thing?、Um, if you feel something personally towards Kayano Ai and you feel like she's taken out, I mean, yeah, I think Kayano Ai doesn't like the fact that she's taken out from all the games as well, but at least she still got a job as a voice actress. She's still voice acting for、uh, animes and whatnot, and I wish her all the best in her endeavors. I think she's still happy at wherever that she is right now. But now, with this new voice actress that c o m e in, I hope that you guys treat her well. If you know her social media, please thank her for、um, doing the voice lines for Platinum and make sure that you really thank her for the things that she's doing. I mean, she, it's a very tough position when a voice actress has to do a replacement of another one.、Um, even the new voice actress will be like, What? I'm gonna take away the work of an old person. But I think Mizuki、uh, pulled her weight, she did her very best. and... I honestly have to thank her for being such a wonderful、uh, VA. Like, it's to the point that you're, you're already tempting me to put Platinum as an assistant. So, all in all, I gotta say, yeah, 
interesting update uh, good job on Hypergriff and let me know how you guys feel about the new voice actress you can listen to all her lines um, she's already changed in the Ark Knights Global game and yeah honestly Platinum in my front screen. I could have just mentioned that at the time of posting this video, uh, probably within an hour or two from the time that I post it, I'm going to be watching the CN live stream for their 2.5 anniversary. So we're going to be watching it to see whether there are uh, new game modes, new mechanics, maybe there's a finally a base change, um, new operators, limited operators. We're going to see all the changes that uh, Arknights is going to bring for the future from here on. So I'm excited to watch it. And if you guys want to see about it as well, you don't mind a bit of the CN spoilers, then do follow me on Twitch. Uh, most likely while you're watching this video, I'm already streaming. So please do come on in. We will watch the live stream together. And I will also make a video to react if there's any significant changes that happen within CN. So all in all, that's that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if not, I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.